So this is the result of, this is what happens when uh, a guy who was one of the dragons on the Dragon's Den show here in Ireland got together with the guy who was making the TV show here in Ireland. So what you're about to see is the result of 10 teams with what looked like half-baked ideas on paper at the beginning, but you'll see what you can do in 30 days. My show basically is shudder, woulda, coulda. Have a think about this. What would you do if you could change a moment in your life? And what we want to do is give people a chance to go back and make regrets that they've had in their lives right. History repeats itself. And if we're to break this cycle, we need to start reintroducing the brilliant minds and wisdom of the past into today's conversations. And that is exactly what we do with our groundbreaking new format, Ahead of Their Time. In each episode, we bring back a brilliant, iconic, historical leader to solve contemporary problems. Our program idea is the secret me, ordinary people, extraordinary secrets. We want to challenge your perception of what is normal. So how would you feel if someone you knew and loved came to you and said, listen, I've got something to tell you, because you know what, they might just have a secret me. It's a new primetime game show where we bring tension and competition to a higher level, 15 feet in the air, where your life is in the hands of a stranger and their skill set. This could be the very first moment in game show history where the audience will be screaming at their TV sets at home for the contestants not to win, but to lose. You take a chef and he makes a meal over the duration of the show. He invites four people, four experts in different areas to bring current affairs conversation to the kitchen. The television aspect is just the tip of the iceberg, but the conversation extends onto social media platforms. The question at the heart of my best friend's wedding dress is which dress will the bride wear on her wedding day? And who will have picked it out for her? That, of course, will be one of her best <coughs> What could be more meaningful than choosing the dress that your friend wears on her wedding day? And what if you get it wrong? We believe the viewers will tune in for the wedding dresses, but of course they're going to stick around for the drama. We are here with the ultimate mental agility game show called The Mind. We search different parts of the brain and how we can test them. Big part for us is shoutability. There is no physicality involved. You would be at home shouting at the screen. Like if I was sitting there with my dad and my brother, we'd all be shouting, competing with one another. We put in a nationwide search for dreams, and the best of those dreams are then picked, and we invite them into a studio setting to pitch those dreams, where the mentors decide on who they're going to take on. We test the theories, targeting the philosophies, and then we see the dream arcs in the book so far, and the grand finale, we see the winner achieve their dream, but also they get to win 100,000. I love quiz shows, and I love TV in general. And the moments I love most on TV are the moments where you don't know what's going to happen next. These are the moments, these are the dramatic elements that are central to the mechanic for this show, The Alphabet. It's the only quiz show where right answers are not enough. Our show is called Stars and Their Pies. It's a celebrity field with food challenge where the celebrities we love cook the foods they love. They bring them to the people for one special occasion all in aid of a charity of their choice. So the, the sell the pies directly to the public and whoever has more money in the tail at the end of the day uh, wins the challenge. I have to say that the last six weeks has been certainly the most fun I've ever had working on a program where basically we're just investing the money and so on. Usually we're trying to make 3D printers and stacks of software that you can hardly even pronounce. But uh, when there are people here digging into people's minds, dreaming dreams, making pies, looking at wedding dresses, uh, it has to be pretty good. <laughs> So thanks guys, um, that is all we have time for, as they say, we'll see you outside.